What is good, YouTube? How's it going? Got another knife review for you guys. This is the TS-195 design. Mazwan Mokhtar design. That's his logo right there. Super cool, super unique design. Really useful blade shape. Got the Warncliffe blade. There is indeed a few fingerprints on there. Definitely could clean those off, but this is an integral, so what that means is the handle is full titanium. There's not two different scales, it's just one solid piece of titanium. No screws or bolts other than the pivot screw. I'm guessing those, I'm not really sure what those are for, but... There's two main ways to deploy the blade is the traditional flipper and the front flipper both have really good jimping on them and both work really well bam this is my first front flipper knife so with that being said i can still open this extremely easily it took me a while to like figure out like if the first few times i opened it i was like I had to do it slowly, but yeah, the jimping on here really grabs your finger, so you just like, and then the traditional flipper works really well, the ergonomics are exceptional, you have a really good finger choil, so you can choke up for precise cuts. And, I mean, this blade is going to be amazing for that, like, with the little, on the tip, you can see it's, like, slightly downturned. And I can just show you how easy it is to just precisely cut. With this. It was like so easy, you cut like butter basically. And this little divot here is another method for deployment. You can, I've seen people like reverse spidey flick it, but I'm not able to do that. You can like use it like this, slow roll it out, I'm not a huge fan of that. It's really sharp, like this edge. Well, it's not sharp, but it really catches your finger. Like, it takes skin off. It's kind of interesting. But, yeah. Such a good knife. The, the pocket clip. Just a normal pocket clip with a ball. Not the best. The tension is pretty strong. It's really going to grab onto your pockets. And honestly, it might wear wear your pockets out a bit but I can look past that because everything else pretty much is really good the really like in the frag pattern the like lines are pretty shallowly milled so it's still smooth but also you can Get a good grip on there. Like I said, the ergonomics are amazing. And this will probably catch like things you're cutting through, create some drag. But one thing I should point out is you can see the little dot right there. That's where the and down inside there you can see there's a spot that is coming in contact with this spot and that's what stops the blade from this part can like coming into contact with the actual like frame and that could be a problem because once you sharpen this down 
to that spot is the is the blade going to be in contact with this like with the frame at that point that would be a, a huge problem but it would take a while to a long time of use to get down to that point but still something to take note of you could always like when sharpening i was thinking you could just put a clothes pin right over this part so you only sharpen this part up only and just leave this part unsharpened it's probably what i will do ts195 Let's see what else can i even say about this beauty oh yeah I already said Mazwan Mokhtar Design. I can leave his link to his Instagram in the description. Feel free to check out check it out. And then M390 Steel. I'm not sure if I mentioned that, but really good steel for EDC tasks. It's gonna hold an edge really well. Really good for like thin slicey blades. Just feels really good in the hand. I can honestly say out of all the knives that I've ever owned and all the I've knives that I've currently own this is amongst the top three and I can just say also amongst the top three are my ProTec Mordax button lock and my Benchmade Mini Adamus those are also up there well one last thing we can observe here, hardware is Torx head screws for the pivot screw and for whatever these are for and also for the pocket clip. Yeah, I got some like, it's kind of dirty, I should probably clean it, but you can tell that I carry it and have been using it, so, which I have been. Alright guys, well thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed learning about this pretty cool knife here. I did. I enjoy handling it as well. It just feels good in the hand. Definitely recommend checking out Tucson. Well, anyway, peace. Have a good evening.